Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is Madden 17 on EA Sports. Opening week in the NFL is an exciting time for everybody, including these two teams here today. It's the Jaguars going up against the Pioneers. The opening kick of the new season is straight ahead as we turn it over to our broadcast duo of Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. All right, Larry, thank you very much. It's the National Football League presented by EA Sports. Tonight, we wrap a busy first week of the season with a second of two on a Monday night between the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Salt Lake City Pioneers. This will be fielded at the six. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. in sync as well the focal point runs catches blocks sets the tone for the offense unable to connect on the first down pass play now it's second down into the league, but people know who he is now. A very fast center fielder of a safety. So now an early third and ten here on their opening drive. Watch 80. Watch 80. Come on, let's go! Watch 90. So the D-line's going to spread out. a simple fly route, wasn't it? No, there's nothing to correct at all. You've got it down pat. And I just remember as a player, when I'd be at practice sessions and I'd hear nine from the receivers, that meant fly route, go, uh-oh, look out. <laughs> that was the nine, and he just kept going all the way into the end zone for the touchdown. This one fielded at the five. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line.
And some changes here as the D-line separates some. And getting a look at the Wildcat here. Here we go! One, two. Now they try the right side here. And some room to work. And a cut to the sideline. There he goes, right side. so demoralizing for the defense. Absolutely, because you've done so much work trying to keep people in front of you. When they're past you and behind you, that's a tough one to swallow. And out now comes Jacksonville as they get ready to go. And that recipe on their last drive that resulted in a touchdown looked pretty good, so they'll be hoping to do that once more. And it takes me back to when we sat with the offensive coordinator and the head coach. They felt pretty good about their game plan. But there were some holes in the defense, and they exploded the last time out. Let's see if they can come back and put together a similar drive. And we'll see if they can do just that. And the big boys up front in the trenches. What do you think of the O-line, Charles? I love them because this is a group that's so cohesive. They know what the man next to them is going to do at all times, and they operate as a terrific unit. Hurry up, here we go! Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Right side catch, get him more. Call it a gain of seven, and it gets him a new set of downs. And there's another completion to the tight end. And let's face it, it is hard to overthrow a six foot six inch guy. <laughs> it is indeed. Quarterbacks like their speed guys. They like that huge six six charge that they've got in him. They really do. And it reminds me of what one great tight end told me once. He told his quarterback, just make sure you throw it up there. You know, kind of like put it up in the top shelf where the kids can't get it. for an offense coordinator to take a big shot downfield because he feels like he can come back in third down and pick up the first down. But sometimes you just don't want to break tendency. Stay with what you are, stay with who you know, and go get the first down. That's exactly what they do. Going to give this time to the tailback. And he's brought down. 12 yards on the pickup. And it'll give the Jags a first down. That's another nice run, and I have to tell you, some of the coaches that I played for, their philosophies were always different when they see a guy running the ball well. Some of them wanted to immediately go to play action and throw it now because it's wide open. But other coaches said, you know something? Until they stop him, that big boy's going to keep getting the football. And that might be the direction that they're going to go right now. Here we go, there we go. Not much. 